and I'll answer any questions that you guys have. Yeah, please. <laughs> yeah, just um, sorry, a question on the highlights. So just so I'm clear, the, the, um, the developer of the game defines the tags for the highlights? Correct. OK, so it, there's no, there's, there's not any standardization at all across games. It's all um, game driven? Yes, everything is passed in the game. So when you call configure, let me go back to the, uh, the configure API example here. Uh, pretty far back. Yeah, so configure takes the localization table of the names okay. of the highlights. So the first, the first thing is an ID, which is the tag. This can't be just an internal code tag, but it could also be the name of the highlight that's displayed if there is no uh, localization table. If you want uh, localization for various languages, you'd provide a table, for example, here, where we have an English and a, Mex and a Spanish sort of translation of the highlights. So if user had chosen ESMX as their user interface for GFE, they would get Resulte Uno as the name of the highlight that appeared in the bar. And when they open up the interface, that would be the name of the highlight. And everything would be localized to that. Okay. Is there a limit to the number of highlights that can be defined by a developer? Of this I'm sorry? Is there a limit to the number of highlights that a developer can put in there? No, like no effective limit to the number of highlights, although okay. you probably want to keep it under 1,000 or something. Oh, like yeah, that. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I just want to make sure. That, OK, cool. Yeah. Thanks. Sure. Um, hi. Hi. I was wondering if you could use this thing as like a pure developer tool and not use the overlay or maybe have your own overlay. Um, I yeah, think OK. Just... Yeah, so absolutely. So um, you're, not, you're not the first person to ask if you could use it as a developer tool. Some ideas that I've heard were to, can I catch crashes? Like if my game is hitting an assert, could I use highlights to capture the last 30 seconds of video that happened before this game assert? And you can absolutely do that. Mm -hmm. um, it, it built into the interface right now without any changes. Um, as far as how to not get the overlay, there is a, so the tag called achievement here, this is actually a, a bit field. So you can, you can Boolean a couple types of tags together. And one of the tags is called unannounced. Uh, and the unannounced tag will not display the overlay when it's captured. It's a purely silent capture. It still captures the video, um, but it doesn't show anything on the overlay. Uh, so that answers the first question you had. The second question is, can you customize the UI itself? And the answer is no. So you, can, you can't skin it, uh, and you can not otherwise change the, the summary window or the overlays, other than to turn it off for capturing highlights right now. Um, can you like make your own and then just send events over to NVIDIA's system to call the same things? I'm sorry, can you make your own what? Like you just have your own interface and you call NVIDIA, whatever NVIDIA's overlay may have events or something that you can just Yeah, so like you that. can, so as far as the interfaces that you can make, you can get the number of highlights and you can know the number of groups. So you can provide you, user interface buttons that say, this is a group that has this many highlights, this is a group that has this many highlights, sort of in-game. But when the user clicks those buttons to open up that group, they have to see the, the summary window, which is sort of def defined and is not scannable right now. Okay. If that makes and sense. Does it have to be an engine plugin for Unreal? I'm sorry. Does, does it, have it have to be an engine plugin for Unreal? Currently, yes. Uh, you are free to grab the SDK and do an inline integration, but it made more sense for us to have it as an engine plugin because it was not really dependent on anything in the engine, and we could provide that pretty easily. Okay. Cool. Sure. Thank you. Good questions. Mm -hmm.